I'm Barry Laminac, and this isn't what happened in sports. Big news this weekend, apparently Texas is number one. <laughs> she looks like the mascot for pumpkin spice. During their 45-10 loss to Clemson, Virginia Tech sprinklers just unexpectedly went off without warning. The team swears that never happens to them. Texas State's Division I basketball team lost to NAIA Catholic School Our Lady of the Lake, who is now changing their name to Bitch Slap River. Alabama head coach Nick Saban tested positive for COVID, but then later tested negative. Apparently he just yelled at the virus until it transferred. Ole Miss coach Lane Kiffin joked that Nick Saban was quote, his father. And based on his coaching record, I'm guessing Lane Kiffin gets his coaching acumen from his mom. Oh look, it's the father, the son, and the Holy Ghost. In Oxford, Mississippi fans booed when Florida and Ole Miss took a knee for a moment of unity. And I'm not sure if they were booing the kneeling or the fact that they live in Mississippi. It looks like Ole Miss started their 2020 season in 1958. During a conference call this week, Ole Miss head coach Lane Kiffin was reportedly heard flushing the toilet, which is probably the closest Ole Miss will get to being number two, but come on. I have a hard time believing that. A toilet in Mississippi? A four and five LSU team announced they are self-imposing a bowl ban this season. What? Okay, well, if we're gonna do that then. I'd like to announce that I am not running for president. Also, the Jets are announcing they are not interested in the playoffs. Seriously, LSU, that's like eating 80% of your meal and then turning to the waiter and be like, yeah, we're not, we're not really hungry. Is this anything like the Cowboys self-imposed 25-year Super Bowl ban? <gasps> a photo went viral of LSU head coach Ed Orgeron in bed with a much, much younger woman. Well, looks like coach decided to give her a full ride. They say love is the universal language, which is good, because she won't be able to understand a word he says. <laughs> During their 55 to 17 loss to Alabama, LSU head coach Ed Orgeron slammed his headset on the ground in anger. I guess he's used to being up 38 off the field. 